Okay, y'all, I'm back with a couple of things that I have been using um, regularly, a couple of things I picked up, a couple of things I want you guys to know about. Um, I'm, remember when I said I was using niacin and it was making my hair grow? It was really making my hair grow, but really bad leg cramps, which is a side effect. So, I had to stop using the niacin. Did grow it out, though, a lot. Um, so, now I'm taking... Um, biotin. Taking the biotin, um, I haven't had any weird reactions, no acne, nothing like that. But, um, so I have been doing that. Okay. Um, a couple things I have been using. I love this here the olive oil edge control. Um, it seems to do well with my edges. Um, anything else is just too greasy and we get a whole lot of grease going and we just make a hot mess. So, I've been using this. Uh, I like it. Okay, um, another thing I've been using to seal the ends of my hair is, uh, this. Uh, Dark and Lovely Moisture Seal really really love this stuff now I know it's probably not good for me I know it's not natural but it works so for now I'm using this until I can find something to replace it with okay on the makeup scene um uh, I ordered some Mark. You know, you guys know I like Mark and Avon. Um, now I ordered some Mark. Uh, they had this uh, special, and um, I got it, and it was, you know, cool. But I could have got this at the ninety-nine cents, so because it's not all that to me. But anyway, just want to show you guys, or I haven't learned how to use it yet. Maybe that's what it is. But it's called Mark Light Show. And pretty much what it is, pretty much what it is, is it's just a, uh, it can be a highlight, what it looks like, it can be a highlight for your skin, um, a, um, I think more or less a highlight because a blush, I didn't plan to do nothing. Not on my skin type. Or not unless I wet it. You know. You can do nothing. Okay. So I just put that on to show you. It's a good highlighter for me. Okay. Um I I just wish it was like a little darker little darker but um I got that and um I haven't really been wearing it because it's not really all that to me now this is the business right here this here I picked up and I don't remember where I picked it up from I know it was a drugstore and this is called touch of life have you seen that? In the store? It's called Touch of Light by Maybelline. Now this here is the business. This here is the business. Now you can put this on and it really does highlight and illuminate the face. You see that? Now I was thinking this I could use this and that mark together and have them work as a pair. Okay. It really does highlight though in the sun. It looks beautiful. Okay. Really like this. Um 
also uh Ruby Kisses have something like this called I can't remember but um same it does the same thing. Okay. Now everybody loves Dollar Tree. We go to Dollar Tree. You know, going in and, and see oh, I've been getting my eyebrows uh done in an Indian store. The string, you know, when they do it with the string, I really, really like it. Okay, so you go to Dollar Tree. I always go to Dollar Tree to see what they got new in the makeup aisle, see what what I can get. You know, just a little treat for myself. You know, I don't got to spend a gang of money to you know get a little rush of you know who I want to buy this. So when I went in there, I seen these. They're L.A. Colors lip gloss and lip duo. Easter. Have anybody else seen them? Okay. I like them, but they only have one color that I can use, which is this one. I guess it's supposed to be Charming Black. But here is the lipstick side. Okay. And then it has the same color as the lipstick but a gloss very nice um I love the color let me show you I already got lipstick I'm sorry guys that's fairly dark look at that color and you can also wear this by itself or on top of your lipstick. Now when you line this, baby that's some color. And it stays on pretty good. Um, I usually seal it with the e.l.f. seal stuff because it does run. Um, once I fill it with that, she's not going nowhere. Okay, but check this out if you can find it. I got it in this color and this one here, and more of a pink. I haven't really used this one, but I have used the one that I did show you, and I love it. Okay, remember for the party, I said I was gonna do a black and sparkle eye, so I picked up. Some simple colors of uh, pot. And it hadn't appeared, uh, occurred to me, I need to buy something to get the glitter to adhere to my eye. So, anybody know um, anything I can use for that? But I got it in silver and gold. How, do, how am I going to get this to stick to my eye? Because if I do the silver, I'm going to, you know, do it. I'm going to do this in my eye. Okay, so somebody let me know what I need to buy to go up under that. But I bought these, and they were $1.99 at Walgreens. Then we went to Walgreens, I think it was the day after Black Friday, and they had these, um, little padded things and they were 99 cents I'm like you know what One, two, three, four, five, six. I said ooh for this amount of money I'm spending and for 99 cents mm, let me get them so it was like these little shadows and um you know little baby shadows Okay, and they have some really good color. Let me show you. Color payoff is amazing. But to be so little. And it's called Cranky Curls. Okay, this is... They don't have any names on them. I'm sorry, guys. But this is like a highlighted color you would use under your brow. Right here. 
I'm just going to show you how much pigment it has. Okay. You got pigment for 99 cents. For sure, you got pigment. Okay. Very nice. Okay, and then it has um, here's a brown. Here's a brown. And I'm just using my finger. I'm not doing nothing special. I'm not even using brushes. That's how I can tell. This this gonna work for me if I can use my finger to make an eye look. This is no tutorial. I'm just trying to show you what it looks like on your eye. Okay. And I think for 99 cents, that was pretty good. You know, I always try to get, like, you know, I'm, I'm trying not to spend a lot of money. So if I can get a nice something bang for my bucks, then I'll go ahead and try to, you know, get it, or try it out and see if it works. So, I was just coming in to show you guys this little stuff that I had, and ask the question about, what do I use to get this to stick in my eye? What do I buy? What's the name of it? Where I get it from? Anybody know, let me know. Alright, this is Black China coming to you with some, some dudes and dads, and some, uh, things I got, and what I'm using. Um, Check it out. Let me know what you think. And get back to me. Bye.